Look at this thing, huh? Universum Super Sound 16,000. 16,000. Wow. This thing is nice. Look at that. That's clean. You don't get them clean like that. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Check this thing out. It's got double, double bunnies. Yeah. I've seen better ones, but this one's pretty nice. So, I don't even know what you can see on camera. <laughs> you probably can't even see it. Hey, there it is. All right, so, yeah. This, what's this? What's this? Thing. Zero hours. Zero hours. <laughs> All right, yeah, we got this Universum Super Sound 16,000. Such a high number. But uh, check us out. This is kind of weird. It's in German. Everything's in German. Except for the caution. Even even the battery compartments in German. Huh? That's pretty interesting, huh? Bet you some German would love this. Yeah, so alright, here we go. Enough about that. Enough about that. So took a little trip to see Ray. Um, Ray called me about two weeks ago. I missed his um, voicemail. So I called him today, uh, a week and a half later, and uh, went by his house. Snagged a couple uh, electronics and um, some video game stuff. So let me grab the camera and I'll hustle around inside the van. Got it all in the van. Pull some stuff out of the box because I just shoved it in the box. I didn't look anything up. I didn't even look at anything. I just said, how much you want, Ray? He said, 150. I said, how about 140? He said, okay. I, I tipped him $4, so I gave him 144. And uh, I think I got 15 items, so I'm $10 an item. Mm, that's not that great, but if you see what I got, you might be like, all right, that's not too bad, all right? Um, this is brought to you by uh, Duncan. Now it's Duncan. It's not Dunkin' Donuts. It's brought to you by Duncan. All right. All right, let's do this. I'll keep the camera running. And if I trip over anything and crush anything, you'll be the first to know. Um, all right, so we got this Sony TC. WR620 new in the box um, foam plastic wrap instruction manual it it don't look you it don't look ever used um, the guy that he said he got all this from said he didn't use any of it he said he had it open a couple times but he didn't use any of it all right just because I didn't show you this in the last video, I'm going to show you this now. These are two items that I got out of um, the $410 Hoarder House. This is uh, iPod Nano. Uh, I have the original box for it and all the paperwork because I grabbed that too. So we have a iPod Nano uh, in the box with some attachments. That works, I tested it. It has one song on it, and it's a pretty clean unit. Then we have this camera. This I got in the lot with the Care Bears. This 
so yeah, gift that keeps giving. It's a even though I didn't sell the cab as yet. But we sold the ink, so we're, we're already in the profit. But it's a very nice condition. No scratches, no dust, no rust. Oh my god, steal it already. We're making a movie here. Jesus. Oh, no dust, no rust. We got a Power Shot SX120IS Cannon. Huh? That's 25 with, with what's there, you know? Plus ship. Plus ship. Adequate shipping. Adequate shipping. All right, so there's that. So there's another $25 in that lot. Um, so I was checking out with Ray, and I paid the man. And then he was showing me his eBay inventory, and I thought I had... I thought I had five. There's one more. Right, he's showing me his eBay inventory, and then he's like, uh, oh, "I got to get rid of these games at the at the um, flea market." Yeah, just take them, he says. So I got five Xbox One games. So Watch Dogs, A Way Out, Destiny, Battlefield. Flashback Classics on a Atari. 50 games on Atari. That's kind of cool. Uh, what do you think? 20 bucks? Think he just gave me an extra 20 bucks? Probably. Alright, we'll call that 20 bucks. Four, bu four bucks each? That's pretty fair. That's pretty fair. Alright, let's try and uh, try and make our way to the back here. Yeah. A lot of obstacles. A lot of obstacles. Oh my god. <sighs> Alright. Stuff kicking around in the back. Beating up on this box. Alright. We got this. It's from Japan. Who the hell makes this? Luxman. We got a Luxman T240. Yeah. When you find a Luxman T240, never. All right, it's brand new in the box. Check it out. A Luxman, just about brand new in the box. We need to put some uh, wrapping on it. Maybe find a manual. It's used in the box. All right, I don't know. I thought it was new. It's used. Uh, we got this Panasonic stereo cassette player, RQJ50. You never know. We got this Polaroid. Eh, yeah, you never know. Five, ten bucks, ten bucks. So, yeah, I'm not doing overly great yet. I'm not doing overly great yet. Keep in mind, we do have the the German boombox. I don't know what the hell that's going to do. We got these Poke TSX 220B bookshelf speakers. And then I just stuffed all the other all stuff that I got inside this box. We got a manual. We got Brand new, never used. Um, and then we got some games in here. We got ATV Monster Truck. We got, huh? That's just weird. Why would they make a game like this? The Suit Life of Zack and Cody. That's some filler. Hey, you just gave me some filler, you know. It is what it is. We got some racing. Wasn't overly keen on any of this game stuff, but Red Bull BC1, we got Monster Jam. Probably the only game worth anything. We got uh, Super Mario, we got Tony Hawk. There's those games. 
see you later. And we got this thing with a game in it. We got a Game Boy Color yellow with the back. It said the buttons don't work, but we get a Wario Land 3 in there, so that's kind of good. And I think there was another, another Game Boy game. I don't really remember. Yeah, this one. Super Mario Brothers Deluxe. I've sold that before. We get some pots. We get some pots. We get. We got Imagination Invaders. Awesome. And we got a, I think a DS. I'll save you the pain. So it's already causing me pain. A DS. I usually get about 20-ish on a DS. 25 with a game. So, put that shovelware with it. Flat rate bag it. Be like 30 bucks with all the shovel and then that game boy might do like 10 or 20 in parts and then these pokes i have to look them up this t240 i gotta look that up we gotta look up the panasonic and i pretty much gotta look up everything i didn't i don't really know what any of this does so, but this is nice, new in the box. It's massive. Massive set of speakers. So, yeah, that's what I got. Let me get back to my position. Then we'll talk about it. Oh. That's a lot of work. All right. That's a lot of work. Climbing in and out of the back of the van to the front of the van. Serious. All right. Let me know how you think I did. I know that's a little, uh, that's a little steep. Uh, I know you guys don't probably pay up for a lot of stuff. tend to pay up for a little bit of stuff. I think it works out pretty good. And uh, let's, we'll, I'll cut some clips through these thoughts so they're not all just random thoughts. So yeah. Yeah, you gotta make contact with the guy in the back of the thrift store. Um, he's gonna help you. Ray, Ray Ray can only do what Ray Ray can do. He can't take everything out of the store, you know? So he kind of been cherry picking some stuff for me. And that's just one, it's one less stop that I have to make. All right, so let's put it that way. You could put the fuel in the vehicle, you could make the rounds, you could go there, you could skunk out three times, four times in a row, that's going to cost you $30. Uh, let's, let's get real, you know, putting gas in the vehicle and driving there is going to cost you money. So, if he's picking it for me, he's pulling it out of there, he's buying it, he's taking all the risk, he's bringing it to his house, you got to pay up. He's a reseller too, so uh, I'm sure he left something on the table for me. I'm sure he researched some of that stuff. And, uh, yeah. On to the next. On to the next. Have a good day. Have a good day. We have snow, sleet, and rain. A little culmination mix here. 
but and we made our way to Wally World and uh yeah that's all I got for you I'm gonna try and trim that out and make it a little shorter peace